Hey, I'm TVK. And I'm Hope. Hope you had a great week, Novi. Let's get into the news for today. Tomorrow we are having a Saturday Academy here on campus for from 9 to 12.15. Some of the workshops available include Odyssey Wear, Credit Recovery, Tutoring in Spanish, AB Calc Prep, Weight Training, Math Tutoring, tutoring and Math IXL. We'll also have a Design Your Own Button Art class, Science Research and in Bio and Chemistry, Yearbook and IB Team Building. As always, those who attend Saturday Academy will earn house points and free pizza lunch. Scan the QR code to sign up now. We have several great college and career events next week on Tuesday. Norco College will be presenting on our apprenticeship program we, where you can earn money while learning and, and trading. On Wednesday, we'll have an RCC introduction and overview. And on Thursday, we'll have a presentation from Grand Canyon University. Make sure to sign up for any of these presentations in the guidance office ahead of time in order to get a pass from the class. Seniors, don't forget that this Tuesday is your last day to purchase your senior panoramic photo for $20 in the ASB window. Don't miss out. And other important announcement for our seniors is the FAFSA deadline is March 2nd. We'll have a Cash for College workshop in the library this Tuesday, February 28th from 7, 4 to 7 p.m. It's not too late to sign up for the Lotus class that PALS is hosting in room 109 during first lunch. Meetings will be every Tuesday for 10 weeks and are intended to help members of the LGBTQ plus community and their allies build relationships with other members while learning about specific topics, such as mental health, dating in the community, finding support, and more. See Ms. Sova Hill to sign up today. Meetings begin this Tuesday. It's Friday and we could all use a little dose of happiness. Let's check in with our doodle and see what makes some of our classmates happy today. Hello, I'm Arturo, I'm with MBTV, and today I'm asking a new person why they're happy today. So today I have... Jacob Moore. I have Jacob Moore. And today on this glorious day, I asked Jacob Moore, why is he happy today? Why are you happy today, Jacob Moore? Because I have friends like you. Yes, friends like me. Search for friends in life. People will come and go, but a friend will help you when you really, when you really need it. I love Nordic Vista High School. Are you interested in joining the swim team? If so, please see Coach Ballard in room 207 or at the pool deck after school. There is no swimming experience needed. Coach Ballard will teach you how to swim if needed. The team is especially in need of boys to join. And yes, you can wear swim trunks. In other sport news, congrats to our boys baseball team on their 8-3 win over Arroyo Valley High School on February 11th. Great job, athletes. It's Black History Month, and in honor of that, we want to share some information with you. Black History Month was created to focus attention on the contributes of African American to the United States. It honors all black people for all periods of U.S. history time. From the enslavement people brought over here from Africa in the early 17th century to African Americans living in the United States today. Today we want to introduce you to one of the most important photographers in American history, Gordon Parks. Gordon Parks is the best known of his photography taken between 1940 and 1950 during the drown of the modern civil rights movement his black and white photos documented life from african americans living and working all over the united states for railroad communities to cities parks was hired by the u.s government along with multiple other photographers to photograph living and working conditions during and after the Great Depression. In this photo, Parks captured two young boys playing in front of a rundown structure. Consider, what does this photographer tell you about the live, living conditions in Washington, D.C. in 1942? In one of his first series of photographs for the government, Parks interviewed Ella Watson, who was cleaning offices in the government where he worked at. 
He learned of her story and hardship and with her permission, went on to photograph her at work, home with her family and in the community. The series offers a multi-layered look at Miss Watson's life, reflecting op oppression and hardship, but also showing moments of spirituality, love, and hope. In 1942, Parks was assigned as a war photographer to document the first regiment of black pilots who were trained near Detroit, Michigan. Many officials in the federal government were not supportive of black pilots receiving publicity. But Parks knew that they were an important historic group of folk heroes that needed to be remembered. Gordon Parks is just one of many important African American artists and individuals that make up of our country's past. We hope that you'll take the time to learn more about Mr. Parks and other important figures during this month. Recently, in Ms. Luther's Film One class, completed a soundtrack challenge project in which each film crew had to use the same soundtrack for a short film. The plot and general of the of their film was to complete up to each team as long as it fits with the tune of the soundtrack. Let's check out one of our team's great finished shots. Wow, great work from one students. Stay tuned next week for more short films from the Soundtrack Challenge Project. That's all we got for our news today, Nobi. Tune in next week and remember to stay safe, stay positive, and most importantly, stay, stay brave. brave. Buenos días, estudiantes. Espero que hayan pasado un buen fin de semana aquí en Nobi. Hay que hablar de las noticias del día. Mañana tendremos una academia de sábado aquí en el campus de 9 a.m. a 12 a 15 a.m. Algunos de los talleres disponibles incluyen recuperación de créditos de ahora y tutoría en español. Como siempre, aquellos que asistan a la academia del sábado ganarán los house points y un almuerzo de pizza gratis. Escanea el código QR para registrarte ahora mismo. Felic felicitaciones a nuestros equipos de béisbol, a los equipos de béisbol de Norte Vista por su victoria de 8 a 3 contra el Rubio Valley High School, que ocurrió el 11 de febrero. Tendremos varios grandes eventos universitarios la próxima semana martes con Norco College y presentará sus programas de aprendizaje donde pueden ganar dinero mientras aprenden un trade. El miércoles tendremos una introducción y descripción general de RCC y el jueves tendremos una presentación en la Universidad de Grand Canyon. Asegúrense de inscribirse en cualquiera de, las, de estas presentaciones en la oficina de orientación para anticipar y recibir un pase para faltar a una de sus clases. Seniors, no olviden que el martes es su último día para comprar su foto panorámica por 20 dólares en la ventana de ISB. No te lo pierdas. Otros anuncios importantes para los seniors. La fecha límite de FASPA es el 2 de marzo. Tendremos un taller de efectivo para la universidad en la biblioteca este martes 28 de febrero de 4 p.m. a 7 p.m. ¿Estás interesado en unirte en equipo de natación? Si es así, habla con el entrenador Bayer en el Salón 207 en la terraza de la piscina después de la escuela. No se necesita experiencia en natación. El entrenador Bayer te enseñará a nadar si es necesario. El equipo necesita especialmente niños para unirse y participar. Eso es todo por el Braves. Espero que se mantengan seguros, positivos y lo más importante, Braves.